Ah, the MSF free, type free Q. Equipped with the absolute zero cannon and looks absolutely pleasing to boot. And the Norayoshi Mecha Godzilla. For a concept build, while it tries to look retro a bit too much, it's not too shabby. I like the barrel fingers and the combiner gimmick. Wait, what about this one? <sighs> what is it? You forgot the UX0293. Stop right there. The name by itself is asinine. The only thing I can give Robani here is decent firepower. But it actually stops. It has zero personality. But I'd only get to round with that stupid jetpack that gives it the name Super Mega Godzilla. Bloody pretentious for such a soulless machine. This Mega Godzilla has no need to recharge and actually made it off the drawing board. How are you going to conquer the Earth with aesthetics only? Because the youngsters and hippies will love it. What? Where did he come from? <laughs> Do you attack? Take this, you overrated lizard! No! No, are you sh Oh, just rip my ear off! Quick! Get the Mega Godzilla! Over my dead body! Alright, I'll rip those wires off myself! Come on, King of Munters! Have at you! OMG 93! I believe in you! Nani? <laughs> that never gets old. Father? What are you doing here? I got wind of your supposed death by Kells or what, but this just adds to the pillar of salt that is my disappointment. Sprinkled with the failing of this combat scenario, even Mecha Godzilla 2 here has accomplished more than my sorry wasted sperm of a son. But Enough from you, boy! Now, you have had this coming since my son's rage started, Kelzomort. Congratulations! Not only have you found a way to control the narrow metal, but also made the right decision to made firepower over coolness factor in a combat situation. I adopt you as my new heir to the Gargan Empire! It is an absolute honor, Lord Cosmodamos! An earth for you, boy! As punishment for stealing my research and stealing our family name once more, you will play Getting Over It! What? With a gamepad! What am I fighting for? <laughs>